In this video, we introduce the motivation of this work and the procedures of our approach, self-supervised environment exercise. It is common that a pre-trained deep air policy, for example here, a robot in the simulation, being deployed in completely different environment, for example here in parks, factories, or households. Infinite number of domains may come in the future. Also, the deployment between these real-world-like domains may also happen. Formalize the navigation task as a Markovization process conditioned by E environment, R find a better as starting and go positions. An attack domain is defined by a distribution of tasks. For example, below, a uniform distribution of these navigation tasks. Such a deployment between different domains can therefore be formalized as a domain adaption problem. This diagram shows the procedures of self-supervised environment exercise. We deploy the source policy in the target domain. During the deployment, the robot will easily get stuck at some difficult scenarios. Then we get a target domain representation through trajectory segmentation. We only select scenarios where the robot gets stuck and get a such a representation of all the difficult scenarios. Then, through the environment synthesized approach, we generate such a training environment set from all the difficult scenarios. After training on the generated environment, we deploy the policies in one of the target domain environments. In the upper left, you can see the agent that was trained on environments generated by again. The top right shows the agent trained on environments that are randomly sampled from difficult scenarios. The lower left shows the source policy, and the lower right, DWA, a classical navigation stack with default hyperparameters. As you can see, GAN could finish the navigation first, the random follows, and finally the source policy and DWA will spend a lot of time and they have a lot of recovery behaviors at the, the difficult scenarios. Then we deploy the robot in physical environment. The video on the left shows the game policy that can smoothly pass through a difficult scenario where the source policy will fail. Thanks for watching this video.